Hello all, Casual King here. Welcome back to Ghost Watchers. We're going to jump into the abandoned house on hard difficulty because as you guys know, it's actually been a while since I played this game. Uh, so I might as well go back to the house that I know. Uh, and then we can look at doing the other maps as I get back into the hang of things. Uh, I've been playing quite a few other games. So it's always that uh, remembering how to play scenario. And hopefully, if we escape, we might get some cash towards that never-ending drone. Use the curse mirror, irritate the ghost, open all taps, bring the curse mirror to the car. Okay, so lots of curse mirror stuff. Alright, as always, good times. Good times in the abandoned house. Can't wait for an update on this. That'll be excellent. How does this work? You can turn on lights again, right? Perfect. Look at that. Look at that, boy. We've already figured it out. It's a child. Nope. Oh, it heard me. It heard me. Mm -mm -mm. Alright, so the temperature's going. Is it going to beep? Is it going to beep? Is it going to beep? It's not going to beep. Put this down. Get the radiation thing going. Got that ticks. Bring all the equipment in. All the equipment in. Uh, bu 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 bu. We don't need to take a photo of anything, do we? No, that's good. I like that. Alright, so this should be all the evidence gathering tools. Ah, okay, so we've got blood splatter. Excellent, I like that. I said I like that. <laughs> Why aren't you talking to me? Why aren't you talking to me? You always stand in this corner and you're like, Bleh, but now you don't talk to me. I see how it is. I see how it is. I'm gonna put this here because I know you like to stand there on the roof and you're like, oh, I'm scary. I'm scary. Oh wow. Oh wow. I'm scary. All right, let's go get some protection. So, also on hard difficulty. Let me just hold this because they do attack you in the van. Um, so we have blood stain straight up. So it's either darkness or vampire. So if it's a darkness, we can use the crucifix. If it's a vampire, we can use salt. Or well, the crucifix also irritates it. All right. So we'll take in this stuff then, and then we'll start figuring it out. All right. Yeah. Let's go turn on all the taps and location then. Come back for the evidence. Oh, never mind. Oh yeah, we need protection upstairs as well. Good point. Thank you, Mr. Ghost. I appreciate that information. I forgot I need to bring protection upstairs. Let's go do that. Uh, so let's go with the... Uh, hang on, let's see. So normal salt works on that guy and holy salt. That, that's holy salt, right? Alright, let's take the holy salt. Does fire... The fire works on the darkness. Excellent. Okay, I might take this with me then. I'll just start upstairs, seeing if you want me to start upstairs. Silly Billy. Silly Billy. Turn on all taps on location, can't kidnap me twice. Ha ha! Third. Third. I see how it is. Oh, now you're turning back off the lights. Wanna save electricity, do ya? I see how it is. 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 Alright, that's turned on. That goes back downstairs. I think that's all. Thingo. Upstairs, there's only those three taps, is that right? Because this is the children's bedroom. Yep, all good. We're just going to go downstairs to the kitchen and... Uh, let's see. Turn that on. Just over here is the toy. That's where I got kidnapped. So, which tap did I miss then? The shower. I've missed the showers, right? I've missed the showers. Alright, one sec. There's a cursed mirror. It's turning off all the lights again. 
There we go. Excellent. We've got the holy salt there. We'll put the other holy salt over here somewhere. We'll go get our crucifix and stuff. Excellent. And now we can start with the evidence gathering. So let me put that down there, put that down there. We'll just get some of the passive defense as well. We can always buy more. Not ideal, but we can always buy more. Alright, put that down there. Seeing as it is a darkness, we can probably... Oh, we got Growling. Alright, let's see how we went. Growling and 500 to 1,000. Okay. Uh, ooh. Alright. Uh, let's see. Radio is Growling. 500 to 1,000. Okay. I just... The darkness. It is the darkness. We now know. Alright, so yeah, the crucifix did work. Um, so it's a darkness, which means... Yeah, it's doing its thing. So we just need to figure out what it is now. It is given an EMF sensor? Really? really? That's interesting. Oh, and it's turning on and off candles. Play with the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll, take the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll, take a voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. Alright, you know what I do need? And I'm gonna go get my favourite thing. I was wondering why it's doing that. So we also got sway side to side on the Ouija board. Uh, move side to side, so it's a senior. Take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll, take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll, take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll. I just gotta be here in case it makes me drop it. Nope. Good. We held on to it. Take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll, take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll, take the Voodoo Doll, touch the Voodoo Doll. Uh, between minus 10 and all that stuff, yeah. Okay. Let me go get the light source, um, and we'll go from there. You guys know by now that I like the uh, lighting system. I think it's fantastic, I think it's excellent. And then we'll go get the cursed mirror and bring it back. Yeah, we know about the growling, we just don't know about the food at all. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Alright, uh, hang on. We're actually vulnerable in the basement. I just realized that. We're actually vulnerable in the basement. Yeah, I saw you on the roof. I saw you on the roof. Alright. I think he is back here. Let's run over to this. I might have to buy another one, but that's fine. Excellent. Bring the curse mirror back to the car so that we get that extra money. Okay. And uh, what was the last thing? Irritate the ghost. So we know it's a darkness, which means we do have to throw a bomb in it. And we can actually use the Issen stick. Um, as opposed to the cross. Now we just got to figure out what it is. So, what we can do... Put this down, put this down because it protects. Take the Vidadol, touch the Vidadol, take the Vidadol, touch the Vidadol. Or not. Um, doesn't interact. So let's just go with this. We need the Golden Bomb, turn on light sources, Holy Fire. I have the Golden Bomb, don't I? Didn't I? Yeah, I got it. Take the Vidadol, touch the Vidadol, take the Vidadol, touch the Vidadol, take the Vidadol, touch the Vidadol. Alright, I just need to go to a light source in case it does make me drop it. What does that mean? Did it like run over the fire or something? Golden bomb, turn on, turn off light, silver bomb. Okay. Uh, we can always go back out and get the golden bomb. Oh, 
All right, let's go turn on five light sources then. Is that fan going? I'm not even angry, that's just amazing. All right, but we've been double kidnapped, so no more kidnapping, please. That would be bad. I don't know what that was, but that was actually pretty scary. That was actually terrifying. You just see these eyes and stuff. I can't see! No attacking me when I can't see! Dude. It's also blowing up all the lights. Once it blows up all the lights. Then how am I gonna. Then how am I gonna do it? You're going that way? Alright, you stay down here then. I need to find some light sources to turn on. We're gonna blow up all the ones down there. I see how it is. Whoa, he's actually right here? That's crazy. Oh, lucky I got my stick out. Why isn't it working? There we go. Alright, I need to actually use the holy fire now, I believe. Use the holy fire and turn off the light sources. So I can probably turn off the light sources already. What, is he going to start turning them back on? That's not cool. He starts turning them back on. Alright, there was... No, nope, he's blowing them up. So he's turning them off himself. But I think they're all off now. Well, so there's a favourite toy. Yeah, he's there, so he's going to attack me. I just got to be careful of the drop mechanic. That's where I'm most vulnerable. Okay. Silver bomb. Catch the ghost. Maybe I gotta turn them on, then turn them off. I hope not. What else do I have? Oh, the cross. Okay. Looks like it only makes you drop one. Is he vulnerable? Like... Is he actually vulnerable to the catch? I don't think so. Last correct action was turn off all light sources. Okay, so then it's not that one. One of the evidence is wrong then. He does interact with the doll, which means it's a withering light. Okay. It's done for, is it? Oh, I gotta get another one. This should irritate it though. And that'll protect me. Okay. So I need another withering light then. Uh, they're expensive though. Yeah. Withering light and... I guess we can... What else do I have? The stick. Alright. I need to drop that down. Do I have this? Is that the only protection I got? It is, isn't it? Well, that's it. He should be vulnerable. Why didn't that go off? Why didn't that go off? He should be vulnerable. Either the withering light or the silver bomb. Now, the problem is. Hang on, I don't like that single source of protection. Is that also done for? Oh crap. I what irritates the ghost? The bombs. Oh boy. Alright, well you should be able to be caught then. Because I said turning off the lights was the uh was the way to get him. And I said correct action was turning off the lights. So it's either this or Silver Bomb. Alright, Holy Fire, turn off all the lights. Withering Light. 
Take the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. Take the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. Take a voodoo doll. Touch the voodoo doll. Yeah, so he's not doing this. He needs to do that. And then we'll be able to see it correctly. Take a voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. Take a voodoo doll. Touch the voodoo doll. There we go. So he's meant to interact with the voodoo doll, but he doesn't. Very good, very, very good, good, very good, very, very good, good. Come on. Got better shit to do with my time. Turn these back on then. We're gonna be like that. Oh no, he moved location, whatever will you do? I'm gonna turn him back off. Lol. There you are. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dude! <laughs> Is he, is he just running around the house? He might be. He might be. Take a voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll, take a voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. I'll put it further into the house for you then. How about that? Now take the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll, take the voodoo doll, touch the voodoo doll. Open and closing doors, open and closing doors. Come on, dude. Ah. See, I can't move this closer because it triggers when he's when he's up here in the corner. So I don't want... I, and then he stands up there, so I can't move it closer there. Then I think sometimes he spawns up through here, so I can't really move this light closer. I can move it, like, completely in the house, but that makes me more vulnerable. So, not too happy about this. Oh, row! Always upstairs going, row! Very good. Very good, Mr. Darkness. Very good. I was very scared at the time. Gotta change my pants. Gotta change my pants. Mm -mm. Turning on lights. You better come and stop me. Turning on all the lights, you better come and stop me. Watching TV, better come and stop me. Wait, did that trigger it? Was that this? No, I actually don't know what that noise was then. That must have been just an upstairs noise. Um, I know how to get into attack. It's risky, but I know how to get into attack. Yep. I see you. I see you. See, it, it's it's still triggering at the show up, which I think is causing the issues. Wait, is he running? No, he's not running. That was a debate. It worked. It worked. Damn it. It worked. Okay, well he's coming. There we go. We got him. Ah ha 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 ha! You're so weak. You can't even attack. Ha 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 ha! It'd be so funny if he actually couldn't attack then. I'd be dead skis. But tested, guys. Once they're completely weak, they're completely weak. I was always had that fear that maybe they could still grab you and kill you and stuff. But no, they're completely vulnerable at that stage. Alright, so it looked like the first um, uh, silver bomb either didn't register, or we might have done it just before the lights off one registered. Either way, we got it. That was good. That was good practice. So this gets me back into the swing of things. Let's go ahead and... I think next video we'll go to the police station. But as always, guys, if you enjoyed it, give the video a like, and I'll see you in the next one.